Hey everyone, here we go again with a masterpiece hunt. We've got a double pack set of all the packs that could have a lottery card in it. Here we go, and as requested by some viewers, I'm putting the Battle for Zendikar first because I have in the past found an expedition in my box of Battle for Zendikar. So it's kind of a dead draw. So let's start here. And hopefully we'll get some spicy pulls out of the remaining slots. Let's move them over there. There we go. We are going to go past the commons relatively quick here. We do you have a skitter skin, cryptic cruiser, sylvan scrying, and a sunken hollow? At least we got a land out of this battle for Zendikar pack. Sunken hollow. Let's scan it up. You can tap it for blue or black. And it enters the battlefield tab unless you control two or more basic lands. And we got a full art swamp. Sunken Hollow is a couple bucks, so we're off to a good start here. There we go. Next pack. BFZ. Or bust. Probably gonna bust. On the spectrum. Whoop, we got a foil. I'm spoiling it here. Grove Rumbler, Jotty Offshoot. Whoops, getting camera. Spawning bed and a scatter to the winds. For three, you can instant you can target counter target spell. And awake it for waking it for three by casting some more. You can put some more counters on a land. Probably not a big one there. A swell of growth and another full art. Aether Revolt. Dang, he is decked out. There we go. On to the uncommons. Life Crafter's Gift, Perilous Predicament, Ridge Scale Tusker, and an Aether Sphere Harvester for the rare. It's a vehicle for three. It's a three five. It's got flying. When it enters battlefield, you get two energy counters. You can pay an energy and it gets a lifelink. You crew it for one. And it's 50 cents. There we go. Another revolting development here. Take into custody. I gotta make sure not to spoil if there is anything crazy in the back there. That happened before. Weldfast Engineer, Gremlin Infestation, Hidden Stockpile, and Akari Zev's Expertise. Sorcery for three, gain control of target creature or vehicle until end of turn. Untap it. It gains haste until end of turn. You may cast a card with converted mana cost two or less from your hand without paying its mana cost. It does a bunch of stuff. You would think maybe it's a good card. Got an island. It's not too spectacular. All right. Amunket. I do like the, the Egyptian theme plane of Amunket. Mummies were a perfect opportunity for zombies, and there they are. Manticores, cheetahs, scorpions. Yeah, absolutely. Bontu's Monument. Onward to victory, Grave Digger, and a Drake Haven. For three, it's an enchantment. Whenever you cycle or discard a card, you may pay one. If you do, create a 2-2 blue Drake creature token with flying. There's a lot of cycling going on with the recent sets. Maybe this one's... Seen a little playing Pioneer? Nope. Been reprinted in Commander, apparently. I'm not going to change it. Next one. There goes your Essence. It's scattered all over the place. Flood Waters. Sixth Sense. Warfire Javelin here. Lay Claim. And Hapatra, Vizier of Poisons. I actually love this card. I played it back in standard for uh, green and black. It's a legendary human cleric. Whenever a patch of Vizier of Poisons deals combat damage to a player, you may put a minus one, minus one counter on target creature. Whenever you put one or more minus one, minus one counters on a creature, create a one, one green sneaky snake creature token with death touch. I like it. A patch is not expensive though. There we go, 72 cents. All right, Oath. Oh man, get open here. A dazzling reflection indeed. Whoop, well that one goes over there. Witness the end 
of this pack right now. It's a Reaver Drone, Gift of Tusks, Devouring Flames, and a Corrupted Crossroads. To land, you can add a generic colorless, or you can pay one life to add mana of any color, one mana of any color, to your mana pool. Spend this mana only to cast a spell with Devoid. Blah. Devoid is just colorless. Why would you just not want some other mana rock? There you go. And a full art. All right, Oath of the Gatewatch, again. The Gambit, let's just skip on through to the Embodiment of Insight. Flaying Tendrils, Reflector Mage is actually pretty decent uncommon, and a Wandering Fumarole. Buck 14 for the Reflector. Wandering Fumarole, you can tap, it enters the battlefield tapped. You can tap it for blue or red. Or you can pay to make it a man land 1-4 that with zero switch this creature power and toughness till end of turn. It's still a land. Okay, that's a maybe. Lands are hard to go wrong with. It's a buck. There you go. Okay. On to the hour of devastation. Devastating my wallet. The Endearing Hope. The Desert. Magmaroth, Dunes of the Dead, pretty cool. Vile Manifestation, and a Dream Stealer for three. It's a Human Wizard, one, two, Menace. Whenever Dream Stealer deals combat damage to a player, that player discards that many cards. You can eternalize it for six to make it a four, four. And let's see here. That's 35 cents. Did we get a foil? No, we got a token. That's it. That's it. All right. Open sesame. Ah, it's a different theme. Even of enduring hope. And some other commons. Like those. Steward of Solidarity. Supreme Will. This was good in standard. Sand Strangler. It's nothing big now. And in Earthshaker Kenra. It's a 2-1 for 2. Jackal Warrior with haste. When it enters the battlefield, target creature with power less than or equal to Earthshaker Kenra's power. Can't block this turn. You can internalize this one. And I got nothing else to write home about there. Alright, Kaladesh. Come on, let's get an invention. Cathartic Reunion. Is there any other kind of reunion? Yeah, I guess there is. Nature's Way, Ceremonious Rejection, Aether Hub, and an Aether Flux Reservoir for the rare. It's an artifact for four. Whenever you cast a spell, you gain one life. For each spell you've cast this turn, you can pay 50 life to make it deal 50 damage to a target creature or player. Kind of hard to pull off when we did get a foil salivating gremlins. 644 is the mystery booster version. Kaladesh version about the same 690. So our big hit for the day right there. And a foil. Pretty much nothing. Alright, last pack in this set here. We're gonna get something eventually. Maybe. Can't guarantee it. Fabrication module, Arbor Back Stomper, Mall Fist Door Buster. And wildest dreams. You pay green and then X twice. Return X target cards from your graveyard to your hand and then you exile it. And then nothing else. So 48 cents. So that does it for this search for masterpieces. Got skunked again. Hey, that's how it goes most of the time, right? Well, anyway, thanks for watching. Um, like and subscribe. Check out my other videos. Check out my eBay store link down below. Tragic MTG. Peace out.